Don't right. keep me waiting. You dropped stuff. I picked it up. I'm your minion here. You're a little unyellow for that, aren't you? Yeah, I'm working You're on kind that of tall, head. too. I've got a suntan. Yeah, okay. No, I'm getting that. All right. Well, just Can anybody lend me goggles? <laughs> Call me Kevin. <laughs> Later. <laughs> I appreciate beauty in all its forms. <laughs> me too, and Thelma, me too. <laughs> <laughs> well, just because you're so beautiful, I'm going to let you list the finalists for best graphic story. Now, best graphic story is a science fiction or fantasy story told in graphic form, such as a comic book, graphic novel, or web comic. Hit it. Okay. Here we go, and the finalists are The Divine, written by Boaz Lavi, art by Asaf Hanuka and Toma Hanuka, first, second. Erin Dies Alone, written by Gray Carter, art by Corey Rydell, or possibly Riddell, forgive me, dyingalone.net. Full Frontal Nerdity, by Aaron Williams, ffn.nodwick.com. That's really not a typo. Well, I don't Full think so. Full frontal nerdity. Oh. No, it's not a typo. Yeah. Okay. Invisible, from the other extreme from Full Frontal Nerdity, we have Invisible Republic Vol 1, <laughs> written by Corinna Bechko and Gabriel Hardman, art by Gabriel Hardman, Image Comics. And finally, The Sandman Overture, written by Neil Gaiman, Art by J. H. Williams the Third, Vertigo. Oh, come on, I can't stand the suspense. Oh. Okay, I'm dying here. And the Hugo goes to the Sandman Overture. <laughs> I thought you knew it would. Really, now must be present to win. It seems like a good rule, right? When are they going to install the teleport? <laughs> I'm now playing the role of Neil Gaiman. He's a better writer, but I think I probably look better in a hat. <laughs> anyway, Neil sent this acceptance speech. Neil says, it meant a lot to see Sandman Overture nominated for a Hugo Award, and was disappointing to see that it had been dragged into the unfortunate mess that the pitiful people who call themselves Puppy had attempted to inflict on Worldcon and its awards. I would have withdrawn it from consideration, but even that seemed like it would have been giving these sad losers too much acknowledgement. I'm, I am proud it won, and prouder by far of the amazing work that J.H. Williams, Dave Stewart, Todd Klein, Dave McKean, and Shelley Bond did. Thank you. Hello, I'm here at playing, I guess, J.H. Williams. Um, I want to read something that was sent. Uh, when first hearing that Sandman Overture would be nominated by the Hugo Awards for Neil and I, it was a tremendous surprise. It's truly an honor to be recognized for this type of award. Sandman Overture uniquely fits into the right sensibilities for this. It was a joy to help create. Thank you, Neil Gaiman, Todd Klein, Dave Stewart, Shelley Bond, and thank you, Hugo Awards. <laughs> 